Hello everyone. Welcome to Infigyan. Today we are going to solve one exponential equation 5 power x plus 12 power x is equal to 13 power x. How we will solve? Suppose I am putting x equal to 1. So 5 plus 12 which is not equal to 13. So x equal to 1 is not our solution. x equal to 2. So yes 5 power 2 plus 12 power 2. So 25 plus 144 that will be equal to 169 and 13 is square is also 169. So x equal to 2 is our solution. Just by putting few values we conclude that x equal to 2 looks like our solution. Now question is, is x equal to 2 is the only solution for this exponential equation? So we will find out this answer in this video. Not only we will find this answer but also we will understand how we can conclude using analytics. Using analysis, using analytical method, how we can conclude ourselves. By finding the first derivative, function is monotonic increasing decreasing, such kind of question we will try to find out the answer. Now point is a power x. If you check the graph of a power x, then that value will be somewhere like this. This is the graph of a power x. It is monotonic increasing function. This is point number one. When a is greater than one. You can think in your mind 2 raised to the power infinity, 2, 3 raised to the power infinity. That will, that value will be infinity obviously. Because you are multiplying 3 times, 3 times, 3 times like that. So infinity. So function will be increasing once you increase the value of x. Okay. So function will be increasing. Once a value is in between 0 and 1. Means it is fractional value. Then a raised to the power x would be monotonic decreasing function graph would be like this. Suppose a is half. I am putting x tending to infinity. Half power infinity. That value will tend to 0. So now you can see if I am taking x tending to infinity that graph should be almost close to x axis. So this depends upon the value of a. If a is greater than 1, function would be monotonic increasing as I have written already there. And once it is fractional value, means a lies between 0 and 1, then that value will be monotonic decreasing. See, this, these two points are important. Now, let us consider our equation again. So equation, I am dividing this equation by 13 power x. So 5 power x over 13 power x plus 12 power x over 13 power x equal to 13 power x over 13 power x so 1. Now exponent property that is a power n over b power n we can write a over b whole power n. So this equation will convert into 5 over 13 whole power x plus 12 over 13 whole power x equal to 1. Let me consider function fx as consider this plus 1 to the left side. So 5 over 13 whole power x plus 12 over 13 whole power x minus 1. Now you can see 5 over 13 the value of 5 over 13 lies in between 0 and 1. Similarly, 12 over 13, that value is also lying in between 0 and 1. So, both functions are monotonic decreasing. If a is in between 0 and 1, we are putting exponent x and that would be monotonic decreasing function. So, both, if you consider both, then both are monotonic decreasing function. Function will dip down, down and down. And this minus value only just put that graph up and down. So it doesn't affect the end behavior or graphical behavior of that function. It will only shift, vertical shift only. Now, <clears throat> fx is equal to 5 over 13 power x plus 12 over 13 power x 
minus 1. What I am going to do here, I am just trying to find out f dash x. If it is coming out negative, function would be monotonic decreasing by mathematical method also. So let me find out f dash x a raised to the power x. The derivative of a raised to the power x is a raised to the power x ln a plus again same thing a raised to the power x ln 12 over 13 derivative of 1 is 0. Now you can see this is positive always positive whether you are putting x negative positive or 0 5 over 13 whole power x would be always positive. This value is again always positive. ln of any number which is in between 0 and 1 always negative. Always negative. So you are adding two numbers. Both numbers are negative. So that means f dash x is coming out negative. Means monotonic decreasing it is monotonic decreasing function fx so that means let us draw the graph now and let me change see the graph now you can see this is your y equal to a 1 and this is addition decreasing function graph means I can write this as 5 over this is 5 over 13 a power x plus b power x graph a is 5 over 13 b is 12 over 13. Now you can see the intersection is at point that is x equal to 2. This is x axis y axis. Now what, what we have done so far? We just proved that 5 over 13 power x plus 12 over 13 power x minus 1 that, that function is monotonic decreasing as you can see also this graph. This is decreasing function and y equal to 1 is the constant function. Since one function is dipping down decreasing monotonic decreasing function it is and another function is a constant function. So only intersection at once you will get you will get intersection at only single point. This is what it is proving by this method of finding f dash x. Show that it is monotonic decreasing. Another function is constant y equal to 1. So only single point intersection we will get. This is how we will proceed our exponential equation in this manner also. This is one kind of solution. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you like this video and please do subscribe my channel. Thank you so much.